Hello all, and welcome back to Kreos Gaming. I am continuing my playthrough of Morrowind and working on gathering funds for the Imperial Cult. This is possibly going to be a, a quick video, depending on whether or not the individual I'm supposed to gather funds from is home. Uh, it's possible that there's actually going to be uh, some foul play involved. Because they said it's not like him to promise something and not follow through. So I am supposed to find somebody uh, of the East Empire Company and gather uh, 1,000 drakes from them. It is Kank. That is such a weird Kank. Is that a C or an E? I always have trouble. No, that's an E here. That looks like a C. So that would be Kanktunian? Kanktunian? I don't know. Anyway, I'm supposed to find him and see about gaining his pledge for the company guard, Kanai Shai, here's a Khajiit. I have never been, oh, locked, okay. I have never been in here before. Um, I just haven't had reason to. I guess we just start asking people about him and see what they say. This is Shazgab Grow Luz Luzgun, I think. Um, greets me as the never Nereverine, and if, I think it started with a C, so I cannot ask him about the guy, okay? What about the East Empire Company, though? What do you say about that? The East Empire Company is a monopolistic mercantile enterprise chartered by the Emperor and managed by a board of directors appointed by the Emperor. The company has sole authority to trade in certain goods, like Flynn, raw ebony, raw glass, and Dwemer artifacts, and it also enjoys favorable tariffs and regulations for import and export of other common and exotic goods like quama eggs, marshmallow pulp, salt rice, and Telvani bug musk. Because of its wealth and the favor of the emperor, the East Empire, Empire Company wields considerable influence in the Duke's administration. Okay, well, that seems... Not necessarily good, but understandable. Hey, are you, uh, you look, you are King Tunian Ponius. All right, sir, what say you? He says, I am King Tunian Ponius, fa Factor in Chief. It's an interesting title. Of the Ebenhart Agency of the East Empire Company at your service. Is this concerning the generous pledge I offered to the Imperial Cult? As a matter of fact, it is. You are from the Imperial Cult, then. I'll be frank with you, but you must keep this in confidence. I cannot redeem my pledge at this time. Our clerk embezzled funds, and to avoid scandal, I am covering losses to the East Empire Company out of my own fortune. Okay, well, I guess I will offer to track down the clerk and recover the gold. Sure. Uh... Okay, that is a most welcome offer. Our clerk, an Altmer named Masanon, absconded with 3,000 drakes. We have no idea where he went. To avoid scandal, we have not reported the crime to the guards. If you can track him, track this Mosanon down and recover the missing 3,000 drakes, I would be more than happy to immediately re redeem my generous pledge to the Imperial cult. All right then, so who is Mosanon? He was an excellent clerk, a proper high elf, well-spoken, diligent, orderly, good with fight figures, reliable until recently. I believe we all noticed a change in his behavior, but thought nothing of it. In particular, we noticed a marked rise in his absences from the office. We have been reluctant to discuss the subject with the other employees for obvious reasons, but perhaps if you are discreet and persuasive, you may learn something from speaking to them. Is there, uh, what about embezzled funds? Is that what got me into this? No, I, I don't think so. So let's ask about that. Did you recover our missing 3000 drakes from Osnan or do you have, have you come to report failure? Hmm. Not yet. Still trying. Well, there well, carry on and good luck. Okay. So now I have to go ask a bunch of people about Mosanon to see if they perhaps know, um, where he may be. Well, oh, I've already talked to Shazgab. Let's see what he says. Uh, so, Mosanon now. He says, I was disappointed in Mosanon, a pleasant, hardworking clerk, then 
suddenly completely unreliable. Before he went missing, I heard that he had been seen frequently coming and going from the Guild Guide service at the Mages Guild in Vivek's foreign quarter. It seemed odd that a clerk with modest pay could afford to teleport so often. Oh, great. So did he pretty much just use up all the money on teleportation? All right, Bolrin, do you have anything additional to say? No, you have nothing additional to say except about other stuff. Okay, fine. Why do you know about the Warlord's Mail? Anyway, uh, finally we will ask Okunchai, who greets me as the Nereverine, and then if I ask about Mosanon, where's Mosanon? Man, he has a lot of stuff he's willing to talk about. There we go, Mosanon. You know, I think he had a Telvanni girlfriend. He kept her a secret. I don't know why, but I saw them together once in the foreign quarter at Vivek. She was quite attractive. Okay. Well, that's getting us somewhere. Well, since you guys seem to know stuff, what do you know, Jazir? Nothing. Uh, greets me as an Irene, and I cannot ask him. Okay, fair enough. He's a Khajiit, you know. Well, yeah. Well, so am I. You think maybe <laughs> he'd butt off to Vivek's foreign quarter with me, and we'll see if anyone... Ah, crap. Well, okay, good. There's stairs here. Like, well, bummer, I fell into the water. Um, yes, let's see. Travel. Vivek Foreign Quarter. Of course, it puts me on the banks outside the Foreign Quarter when where I need to be is inside the Foreign Quarter uh, and at the top, but that's not hard to get to. So, one guy may have been mistaken, I suppose. It may not have been that he was actually using the Guild guy. It may have just been that he was meeting with the... Uh, um, Dunmer. Now the flip side is the other guy could be mistaken if you're that he didn't actually have a Dunmer girlfriend and that was just how some people explained his presence in the foreign quarter so frequently. But I should be able to work out the difference between those two maybe even by just going and asking the guild guide. I think I will start there. That might give me some additional information. This is the Fighters Guild, so I need to get over to the other side. They did say Dunmer, right? Telvani. Yeah, Telvani. So that's going to be a... That's really weird to go to the Guild of Mages, though, because the Telvani are the Welcome. mage arm of the Great Houses. Um, well, let's find out if she has anything to say about... Um, Mosanon. Alright, she can potentially answer a question, and she says, Yes, I remember a higher el high elf named Musanon. Went back and forth from Sadrith Mora quite a lot while back. A while back, excuse me. Sometimes traveled with a Telvani woman, but I haven't seen him recently. Okay, well, let's jump to the other side then, in Sadrith Mora, oh, and ask this How guild guide Maybe talk. about uh, Musanon. She says, A high elf named Nosanon, traveling with an attractive Tovani woman. I don't know anyone by that name, but I have seen a high elf in the company of a local woman, Volmini Drawl. She has a pod over near Wolverine Hall. She's young, but not all that attractive. Okay, well, you're also, I think, one of the uh, types of elves that Welcome, he is, a high elf, so you may just not find. Well Dark Elves are, or uh, Dunmer attractive? I don't know. Um, okay, so she has a pod. That's the Apothecary. There we go. No, Tendra no. Strahl's house. No? Was that not it? Oh, it didn't update my notes when I talked to her. No, but I don't know for sure. Maybe it was. Okay. Well, um, I can go back and ask since I didn't go that far. And since I can't, I forget names too easily. I'm rather surprised it didn't update my notes, though. All right. Come in here, ask again. No. Volmini Drawl has a pod over near Wolverine Hall. Okay, so Volmini Drawl. Well, I mean, this is Wolverine Hall. 
So somebody with a pod near Wolverine Hall would have to be here. That's Trendris Drawl. Now, maybe Valmini is related to Tendris? I can, I'll still go start there, see what that leads to. I guess I could also ask other people about Volmini Drawl if that's a new one. Um, but first, let's just go to the house, the Drawl residence, and see what I find. Well, beyond measure. well you're Trendris Drawl. You do not have what was that? any extra Good levels. Day. All right, so let's talk to you. Uh, greets me as the Nereverine, and if I ask about Musanon. A High Elf named Masanon. I don't know anyone by that name, but there aren't many High Elves in Seldrith Mora. Why don't you ask Sinyaramen over at the Gateway Inn? He's a High Elf and a traitor. He might know. Okay, so Drawl it may just be... Hmm. Yeah, because that's getting into the Telnaga Great Hall. Seleth, Arvon. Sadras Mara, Ferris Hole in the Wall. So I think there was one closer to Wolverine Hall yeah. on the other side. On this side? To the right a little. I mean, you've got Dirty Muriel's Corner Club, you've got the well, it was just that there's that. It looks like there's another building right there. Right. It just doesn't appear to have an entrance. I mean, I can still go check it out. It could actually. It's just that. Oh, okay. But coming over here and asking at the corner club, I think, is going That's to be a potentially worthwhile endeavor. <clears throat> I work <clears throat> big Helen. What can I do for you, Master talk. Thief? Well, you can tell me whether or not you know anything about. No, you can. Ah, there we are, Mosanon. A high elf, don't know. Okay. Volmini, so she's still referencing Volmini Drawl. Pot over near Wolverine Hall. She's young, but not all that attractive. Except, I'm so confused. What does a pod mean, then? Does a pod potentially not mean one of these mushroom homes? Does it mean something else? Oh, gosh. I couldn't see the square. So, yeah, it's just one beyond. Oops. Yep, there's Volmini Drawl. There are no... Well, hold on. What is this regarding Khajiit? Hello. You are Masanon. You, have my you know what? Let's start with Volmini just to see what she says. Because that could be interesting. Alright, Volmini Drawl says... I'm Volmini Drawl, and this is my home. What do you want from me? I would like to know about Masanon. Yes, he is a high elf, and he lives here with me. We are very close friends. Okay. Well, that's an interesting statement to make. And Mosanon, what say you? He says, yes, what do you want? Um, want to ask you about embezzled funds. Yes, I took the 3,000 gold. It was foolish and wrong, but I was in love and thought that Volmini could only love a rich man. I was wrong and foolish. Now I know she loves me, not my gold. Now I only have 2,500 gold left. I spent the rest. I'll give you the 2,500 gold and promise to pay back the rest as soon as I can if you will promise to keep my whereabouts secret. From Cantunian Ponius, if arrested, I'll be sent back to Cyrodiil for trial and be separated from my precious Volmini. Uh, demand the gold and make no promises. Promise secrecy and take the gold. Take no action and consider the offer. Oh, well, I don't know that demanding the gold would do me much good. If he doesn't have it. Oh, promise secrecy and take the gold. Sure. There we go. I think I am a good judge of character. I believe one earns one's character by effort, and I can sense that you have taken the care to build a personality that inspires trust. I will honor your promise, take the gold, and Volmini and I thank you for keeping our secret. Your journal has been updated. 2,500 gold has been added. Goodbye, sir. He's done, though. Useless. 
Did you just say these Dunmer are useless? Huh. That seems... Unwise. <laughs> but that's probably just a default racial uh, characteristic that they gave to that particular, uh, to the Altmer. That's what they're called. All right. So now I can go back. Um, I think I'm going to say that I was only able to recover 2,500. Although I suppose to more thoroughly uh, cover for him, I could say that I've gained all thousand or all three thousand again it would only cost me 500 but Welcome, easy for me to say now that i am um over leveled and over supplied um i don't think i would be nearly that flippant about it in if i were running these as the beginning missions i would probably be trying to scrounge um every amount of gold i could but we'll see. Uh, I mean, okay, where am I? Where's the boat? The boat's there. Do I make it? Woo! I make it. Nice. Well, not quite as good as fast traveling, but better than ah, running the entire thing. Other than I can't walk, apparently. All right. Sir, travel to even our... No! Dang it! Travel back. Oh, I can travel straight to Evenheart. Good. Bit of a roundabout way to get there. It cost me a little extra money. But. So be it. Alright. I don't know how many quests I have left for Eulis after this, though. Possibly not many. Excuse me. I know that there's at least one other quest giver for the... Um, Imperial Cult once I am done with Aeolus quests, but not specifically how many he has. This could be the last one. It is a rather... I don't need to go to Aeolus yet. Crap. I am supposed to report to the gentleman at the uh, company location. I am glad I remembered that before talking to Aeolus, because I would have just said, yes, here's the money, and that, that would not have gone right. Um... I guess I could have gone back to the other guy and said, yes, here's the money, and seen if he'd... Although I suppose I have 2,500 gold, and it was only for 1,000. I don't even have to come back. I could have just gone to Iulus and then pocketed the rest. Huh. That's not right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kang Kangtunian. Such a weird name. All right. I am a generous pledge. Can I embezzled funds is what I'd like to ask about first. Did you recover? I was... Nope. Here's... I can't say... Interesting. I cannot offer all 5,000. Or all 3,000. Okay, well, 2,500, all I could recover. A pity, but something is better than nothing, and what you have recovered will at least permit me to redeem my generous pledge to the Imperial Cult. Um, so 25 has been removed, my journal has been updated. Now if I ask about the generous pledge, he says... Thank you for recovering our embezzled funds, and here are the 1,000 drakes I pledged to support an Imperial cult mission to the Ashlanders. My journal has been updated. Awesome. Um, what book is this? East Empire Company Ledger. Ledger contains items bought and sold by the East Empire Company here in Vardenfell. I don't want to take that. That is my usual habit, but that would likely result in bad things. He does, however, have a Dance in Fire Chapter 6. I gained knowledge from this book. My mercantile skill and skis increased to 23, which means I don't have it yet. Thank you for your additional donation to my own personal stash. Um, and so long as I'm here and being sneaky. 50 gold. Sure. That will be for my expenses traveling to recover your stuff. Because while you know me, as a representative of the Imperial Cult, I have uh, other associations. That, uh, anyway. Okay. Master Thief. Yes. Have to uh, maintain skills and habits. If you don't use it, you lose it. I mean, probably not in this game, but whatever. Okay. 
You can only be reformed so far. Uh huh. And nobody said anything about a reformation. I, I'm not. -uh. I have not renounced anything related to the thieves' guild. I just happen to be working for other people, who keep telling me that I can't steal from them. But nobody said I can't steal from the East Empire Company that I'm aware of yet, other than the law in general. But that's not the point. All right, Eulis. Have you spoken to Cantunian Pontius? Have you brought the generous pledge he promised to support a mission to the Ashlanders? Or have you come to report your failure? Um, yes, I have the generous pledge. Thank you, Drolin. You have exceeded our greatest expectations. I'm afraid we have no more tasks to challenge your remarkable abilities. I suspect you already outstrip your teachers. Perhaps you will consider becoming one of our lay healers or shrine sergeants if you have not already sampled these duties. I have also passed your name to our oracle here, Lalatia Varian. She may have tasks suited to your talents, but before you go, I have one last gift for you to remember us by. Goodbye and good luck. And that gift is Xenathar Whispers. Is that a... I have no idea what that will be. By the way, if I talk to you again, can I ask about advancement? Because you haven't given me the opportunity to ask about advancement. You have the attributes and skills we expect, not yet dedicated enough time and service. Oh, all right, cool. And now, of course, I've forgotten what he told me he gave me. Xenathar is something, right? Whispers. It is a... Um, probably an amulet that costs charm 30 points for 5 seconds on touch. Okay. I don't know. Um, Hold on. Because I know I already asked someone else about the sergeants. Shrine sergeant. There we go. But I'm hoping he'll tell me who the lead is. Uh, shrine Sergeant helps keep order at the shrines, carries messages and packages, sometimes supports, escorts priests and lay servants on dangerous missions. For bold, free-spirited adventurers like you, if you are interested, speak to K at the Imperial Chapels. Okay, so now I'm looking for K for my next job. Because I'm pretty sure that the gal up there is the Oracle. Yep. But I don't want to work with her until... The last. Are you K? No, you're Frick. You choose to share your time. You're K. Stay as long Hello, K. Would be a K says, to talk with you. Hello, Invoker Drolin. My name is K, and I'm in charge of the Volunteer Shrine Sergeants for the Cult. Are you ready for a Shrine Sergeant assignment? I am ready for a Shrine Sergeant assignment. Good. I could use a little help here. We treated a High Elf named Karyural for Swamp Fever but we later discovered that while he was here, a rare chapel limeware bowl disappeared from our shrine. Will you find this car URL and retrieve our bowl for us? The High Elves are a small, tight-knit community on Vardenfell. Try asking other High Elves if they know car URL and where he lives. Okay, what do you know about car URL himself? Uh, he was a tall, dark-haired fellow with sharp features but that description would fit a lot of High Elves. We were treating him for swamp fever, so perhaps he lives along the coasts, when mud, where mud, when mad crabs sometimes carry disease. Okay. As I said, try asking around among High Elves. I believe there are several serving in the Hawkmoth Legion garrison here in Ebenhart. Alright, so I'm just going to check my journal real quick, make sure it does say I'm looking for Karyurel. Good, good. And I will go ask... Uh, other high elves about him in the next video for now thanks all hello all and thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video please click the like button below you can also subscribe using the channel image in the center of the video if you are interested in more content in this video series to the left is a link to the full playlist alternatively when it is available to the right will be a link to the next video in the series thanks all